halfway platform here. Has a little look to see whether there's room there. Well spoiled by Ellis. There's a chance for the opposite number. Needs to driven back. Bridge end there in numbers and in force. And yes, the try is awarded. Gerald Williams probably at the bottom of all that. And ironic, a former Neath player. Bryant, Simon Bryant, the bridge end number eight with the red headband. Not selected for the varsity match this year. This is a nice angle from Williams. Had it, that's well supported from the other Williams, Gerald. And a good pass, this is Ellis, number nine. Support all of it on the inside, no one outside of him. Intercepted by Bridges though. The scrum half has a long way to go. Be caught by Luke Evans. And Alan Williams finally pounded out of play. Well, two scrum halves there had good runs, but not well supported either of them. Well, again, Neath the taking it. This is good ball. This is Phillips. The flank here, that is. Roland. No real momentum. This is the other Phillips, Kevin. Good support from Pew. The other prop, Williams. This is better from Neath. Laid back is the space blind side. This is Williams. Halfway through the gap. Very yes, that is an excellently constructed try. That's perfectly done. And Thorpe with the try. No, it's not a try. There are so many options on here for Neath. Williams positioned very close to the scrum. Could be a, a dummy run here somewhere. Leite has come in for a short one. It's being held by the forwards and Jones scores. Not to be denied on the third occasion then. Neath score and the try scorer, Mark Jones, his fifth of the season. Paul Thorburn with this kick to put Neath in front. And succeeds. This is a classic position for the Jones-Bridges combination to come into action. Well, Jones thinks he can get there. He's kept possession. That's hacked away. And a penalty try awarded for the ball being kicked out of the scrum. Obvious pressure there. The Neath scrum, so solid. Lots of options blindside. But Jones confident, following his first try, that they could take it on. And then you see the foot coming in, the ball wasn't over the try line. And the referee, no hesitation in awarding the penalty try. Thorburn with his second successive kick. Paul Williams again poised there, probably will join in if he feels there's a need for an extra body in that scrum, because again, Neath are keeping it tight, are trying to use that power of theirs up front. Although the scrum half, the front row this time has come up, Jones sets off on that charge, typical charge, and again scores a try. His second, and again exactly the same position. The solid platform, he was over in the corner. Regen reduced the arrears with a penalty. Neath then 18-7 ahead at half-time. Can Neath then produce something from here? It's been all tightly controlled until now. Williams, though, will, no, doesn't attempt to drop kick at goal. Finds a huge gap, in fact. Now gets support from Phillips. Pugh is poised. So is Williams. So is Phillips. The three front row men are there. Oh, so eager to have a little charge at that, at that bridge end defence. Williams is the key at the moment. Still going on. The referee points to the bridge end midfield to keep behind the offside line. Webb has come in into an offside position, but it's still been taken on. The half a metre short, Phillips. Uh, 
each one of Neath's tries has come from this sort of position. It's been held in the scrum and Jones, but this time Bridges has a little go. Still on his feet. Yes, and a try. Well, that just proves the power of this Neath team. An unconverted try, and it's now 15 points the difference. Lots of movement off the ball, out wide here as Ellis sets off on a run, space for Parry, intentionally knock on, no says the referee, yes says the referee, finally. And strikes that well, success for the fullback, and it's now 10 to the home side, 22 to the visitors. Still lots of room on this blind side. Regen up for the open spaces as Williams skips clean through. What a try for Alan Williams. Well, tremendous play from the outside half. So quick to exploit the gap. And his 14th try of the season, and so well deserved.